I'm John Mayo. I'm a professor here in the college, and I'm also the director of the Social Science Scholars Program. This is an innovative program now in its 11th year. Each year, we select 18 promising juniors from across the college, selected on the basis of their academic achievement and their service and uh, contributions to the college and, and, the, and the community. The program includes an innovative sem leadership seminar at which we review leadership from a variety of not only social science but other perspectives as well. The students develop a project in this seminar which they then undertake during the summer between their junior and senior year. It's a wonderful opportunity for internships and for them to spread their wings intellectually. They return in the fall, we have a follow-up seminar, and then uh, they graduate the following spring and are off into the world of graduate education and work internships across the country and around the world. We're very proud of our graduates. The social science scholars have gone on to remarkable careers, many in law and other professions, and some in foreign uh, capacities, including three current foreign service officers. Hi, my name is Nastasia Jambier, current student body president at Florida State University. I'm obtaining my master's in public administration and I completed my degree in interdisciplinary social sciences at Florida State. I had the opportunity to participate as a 2020 social science scholars. During my program, I created a community organization called Movement 850. Movement 850 is a community organization to address racial inequality and police brutality in Tallahassee, Florida. Through this, we were able to work with different police agencies and create a community citizens review board. With the Social Science Scholars Program, I was able to build myself as a leader with other community organizers and also build essential skills for my future profession. As a Social Science Scholar, you have the support of your cohort and also alumni who have been in your same exact shoes and are in future professions which you aspire to be in. This proves to be so essential as a student and a leader who is always developing and trying to create more opportunities for growth. One unique aspect of this pro program is that it has been uh, supported by amazingly generous friends and graduates of the college. So for the summer projects, each student is entitled up to $5,000 in expenses. And this allowed, has allowed them to travel, to uh, attend uh, courses that sometimes require uh, tuitions, it just makes their summers much more uh, ob obtainable financially. Hi everyone, my name is Rowana Pari. I am a junior here at FSU. I use she, her pronouns, and I'm majoring in economics, Middle Eastern studies, with a minor in political science, and on the pursuit of achieving a global citizenship certificate. I am the 2021-2022 Executive Director of the Office of Governmental Affairs within SGA, and I was happy to be a 2021 Social Science Scholar. The Social Science Scholar Program not only provided me with the uh, tangible scholarship of up to $5,000 to pursue any type of leadership opportunity, but it challenged my conceptions of what leadership is. In the, in the three credit seminar that students take in the fall, you have to cultivate and create uh, a leadership proposal that can align or not align with your summer project. And the two professors, Professor Mayo and Professor Taylor, consistently push you and ask you, uh, how can you achieve, how can you achieve that? What about the challenges with this stakeholder? What about the challenges within society? And uh, not only was I able to just uh, listen to the echo chambers of leadership that I'm already aware of, but I got to be challenged to know how to actually create those types of changes and shifts that so many around the world are already doing today and seeing how it actually takes shape in an international realm. And then I got to carry that into my three summer projects that got to intersect with uh, traveling to Jordan in the Middle East. I traveled to Amman to visit family and get a little bit of an insight into what I'm studying, which is the Middle East. I got to do research with the Education Development Center and their work in Egypt about teacher incentives and climate change in developing nations. And then lastly, I got to participate, although virtually, in the Florida uh, Summer for Undergraduates program here at the law school. It's four intensive weeks of gaining law school experience to figure out, is law school for you? Is it not for you? Uh, what the admissions process looks like and the greatness of FSU law. So FSU law definitely bumped up on my law school list and it was a great summer that taught me a lot of different things of academic and career, but it all cultivated into leadership that I got to take from the fall semester class. So I was really lucky and fortunate and I 
recommend the program to anybody who else wants to gain those different leadership opportunities as well as gain the opportunity of the scholarship itself. The alumni of the program and the student side not only give you advice on how to take on the application process and how to internalize the leadership lessons that you get, but they can also be the connection to your opportunity. They can be the connection to a future job, to a research professor, or to somebody in the community that you can work with. They, they went through the process and then you're going to go through the process as well, so they are your biggest source of information out there that can that can lead you in the right place and they uh, surely helped me profess the professors in the program helped me as well land one of my opportunities and uh, everybody around you is there to help in the program if not anything is teaching you leadership but I know for sure the biggest thing I probably took away is that I would always leave the space energized hearing what my peers were trying to tackle themselves even if it differed from me it was always the most intriguing and the most inspiring I had the most motivation those days